Can clobetasol propionate be used for hair growth? Hello everyone. In today's video, we're going to talk about clobetasol propionate and whether it can be used for hair growth. This is a topic that has raised interest in the health and beauty community. Let's dive deep into it. What is clobetasol propionate? Clobetasol propionate is a potent topical corticosteroid that is used for treating various skin conditions, including psoriasis, eczema, and lichen planus. It works by reducing the actions of chemicals in the body that cause inflammation, redness, and swelling. Can clobetasol propionate be used for hair growth? Now, on to the main question. Can clobetasol propionate be used for hair growth? The short answer is, it's not intended for that. Clobetasol propionate is generally not used or prescribed for hair growth because it's a potent corticosteroid meant for managing severe inflammatory skin conditions. However, there are certain scenarios where it has been used in conditions associated with hair loss, such as alopecia areata, an autoimmune disorder that causes patches of hair to fall out. In such cases, clobetasol propionate may help slow hair loss and potentially encourage new hair growth. But remember, this is off-label use and should only be done under the direct supervision of a healthcare professional. What are the risks and side effects? It's crucial to understand that using clobetasol propionate without medical guidance can have risks. Long-term use, especially on large skin areas, can lead to side effects like skin thinning, hormonal imbalance, and even adrenal gland problems. It's a powerful medication, and misuse can lead to more harm than good. In conclusion, while clobetasol propionate has been used in certain instances to treat conditions associated with hair loss, it is not a general solution for hair growth. It's a potent corticosteroid primarily used to manage serious skin conditions. If you're concerned about hair loss or are interested in treatments to promote hair growth, it's always best to consult with a healthcare professional. They can guide you towards the best, safest solutions for your specific circumstances. Thank you for watching, and we hope this video has been informative.